Did you know that 47% of employees consider meetings to be the number one time waster? And that in the US alone, there are up to 55 million meetings each day. Which leads to employees spending an average of six hours per week stuck in them. And even worse, half of those meetings are poorly rated by their attendees. Those meetings aren't just a waste of time. They cost a lot of money as well. Each year, roughly $200 billion are wasted on ineffective meetings alone. But here's the thing. Meetings don't have to be bad. We can fix them. And really, we should. Because the good ones are actually crucial for collective decision-making, planning and follow-up, accountability, engagement, and other practices that will help you to build a thriving organization. So, let's take a look at how two pioneering organizations have created worthwhile meeting structures that help their meetings to not only be effective, but also fun. Yes, meetings can actually be fun. We'll start with Buurtzorg, one of the world's largest and most radical self-managing organizations. Meetings at Buurtzorg are hosted by a facilitator in the team. There's also a secretary who makes notes. The meeting starts with some fixed agenda steps where the team discusses a text report of the previous meeting, goes through a round of announcements and any other business left to discuss, and then determines the agenda on the spot. During this part of the meeting, there isn't room for any discussion. This takes us to the next part of the meeting, discussing agenda items. For each agenda item, the team follows six steps. The item owner introduces a question or proposal, points out the reasons for discussing the item, and then provides clarity on the actual purpose for discussing the item, which could be to inform others, to ask for advice, or to make a decision. After that, the process of informing, advising, or decision-making takes place. When a decision is made, the next steps are made by answering two questions. When will the decision be executed? And by whom? The secretary records these actions. When the item is addressed, the team moves on to the next agenda item and starts the loop again from step one. And there you have it. That is how they run meetings at Buurtzorg. With this meeting structure, Buurtzorg makes sure that meetings are solution-driven, effective and efficient. Let's talk about another pioneering organization that succeeds in running effective meetings. Visi, the first financial services company to implement 100% self-organization. At Visi, there's always a facilitator who hosts the meeting and a secretary who records the decisions. The meeting starts with a check-in round, where everyone shares how they feel. This helps to switch the focus onto the meeting. After this initial check-in, a checklist of actions is evaluated with a simple check or no check to each action. Then it's time for a performance review, where the latest data concerning the team's performance will be shown and explained. The meeting continues with a project update where only changes are discussed. Next, an agenda is set up on the fly based upon operational issues. Once the agenda is ready, any pressing issues are dealt with so the team can take action as quickly as possible. During this step, the facilitator first asks the item owner what they need. Then, the item owner shares information or requests operational needs. The secretary then notes the outcomes and any to-dos. Finally, the facilitator asks the item owner if they got what they needed. If not, they walk through the steps again. If the item owner did get what they needed, the team moves on to the next agenda item. After all the issues have been dealt with, the meeting ends with a checkout where everyone shares a closing reflection about the meeting. And there you go. That's how Visi manages to run meetings in a quick, clear and effective way. So, 
Do you want to give your meetings a serious upgrade? Learn about these and other powerful meeting practices in our online courses. To find out more and get connected with a global community of like-minded people, go to corporate-rebels.com slash academy. Thank <laughs> you.